funny, it always seems to me that during activities I um, I'm all focusing the the projection <laughs> and then when I stop I I the mind put the questions and I see it's it's the, the, the illusion, the illusion, and I see that I just probably so hypnotized or so want to be in the dream, so I don't even remember sometimes to to stop. Inwardly, not not physically, and and when the stop happens, then it looks so obvious that this is the only thing that really exists and really the most important thing, and then uh, and then it, it's uh, it's funny because sometimes the mind make a decision. Now I will be more focused on that because this is really what's important and this is really what I want, and then. <laughs> it's get involved in something and get lost in the dream again and forget about all the decisions you made or the, the determination or the, the desire to really put the attention in the, so and, and it's not just a thought I really see when I stop I really see that this is really is the most important thing and this is really is the, the only thing that really that really is, and all the rest is just stories that I imagine. But after that, I it passes, and the experiences I don't sense it uh, so strongly, or the attention goes outward, and I just forget all about it. Because vigilance is required in every step of the way. <laughs> vigilance. Uh, Adult, eh, eranut. Determination? No, vigilance. Vigilance means you're so vigilant that you are aware of every slight movement. Alert. Because If there is no alertness of what appears, you think that you are the appearance instead of that which is aware of it. Mm. Therefore, on moment to moment, when one is speaking, you listen to the words, whether it's what you think your mouth speaking <laughs> or other mouth speaking. When action happens, you pay attention to how the body is moving, standing, not standing, walking, leaning, not leaning. Now no rules apply. It just for example, if the body stands and I put the hands in the pocket, I always notice. I don't need to change. I'm just aware. Because that means I am the ultimate awareness, which is always aware. Awareness has no preferences. It doesn't change any behavior. It doesn't have any preference. It just sees clearly everything as it is. It's just an example. People tend, when you stop, how you, st how you sit. You can sit like that, that's okay, just be aware. You can sit like that, that's okay, be aware. Notice the difference. You speak with somebody and you're like this. Check what are you trying and what do you want. Or you can just be relaxed with no agenda about anything. Just be aware, alert, like... Um, Like an ego, 
that it is alert watching the prey from so far above it's watching every slight movement of the mice so and it, it tracks it or the birds they go above the sea and suddenly they die they are fully alert and you see they're so relaxed flying yet alert so alertness it's not like it's totally relaxed that is tense not but, alert. Yeah, totally relaxed because there is the notion that being alert I have to do something no alertness and you is one and the same you are that alertness which is ultimately <laughs> alert only for itself ערנות זה לא מצב שאני עושה, זה המצב הטבעי של עצמי, בעצם ערני. אז זה שערני ואני הם אותו אחד. אלרטנס, ערן, זה מסביר? מה, לא מסביר? <coughs> אז תשאלי את השאלה מה לא בעיה. אני חושב שהוא עוזר. חשבתי שלא הבאתי את התרגום, עכשיו שאמרת בעברית אז לא הבאתי את העברית. If you are sitting and you feel tired, it's the mind, it's not you. It's the mind that is tired. It's the physical body that might be tired. Awareness is never tired. So when you directly experience awareness, you cannot experience tiredness at the same time. This will give you the ability to discriminate whether you experience a state of the mind or you experience the realm of awareness. I am actually aware that my body is uh, very tired, like tiredness. And the contraction that my mind so much this happening this contraction is there like like squeezed in one point maybe but I am also uh, at one level I'm also aware of it like a, like the emptiness and the silence which exists is there but it's like like a It's like, like a, one part is like trying to pull me down like a, to this contraction, like it's going very, very, very squeezed, like something like this. And uh, on the other hand, there is the freedom also that I am... Uh, you, you have uh, something there, like... Uh, what? The, on your, what is this, this cloth? Yeah. 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 Do this. Squeeze it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, just hold it. Yes? Yeah. Just like that. Yes? Is it pulling you down? Pulling me down? Yes. What do you mean? The squeezing. Is it ah, pulling the squeezing? Is it pulling you down? No. The awareness <coughs> is the same. <coughs> you just think I am this contraction. Yeah. So this pulling me down, yet you are just aware, watching it all. Mm -hmm. This cannot pull you down. I guess only the notion of me makes the difference. Yeah, except this is good because this notion of you is seen by who? It's just seen by you. 
So the notion of you is not you. I want to allow to this contracted part to be one with the that it is. The one who wants to allow it, interfere it. <coughs> you as awareness doesn't want anything. It doesn't really care about this. And they coexist simultaneously. Awareness and the attention of the mind goes to this. And then it says, I, the body, a separate entity, want to allow this. Now that's a story within you that the mind tells itself. As you sense this awareness, which is you, if the attention goes to it, see if you can just bring the attention in such a way that you notice without a thought about it, just now. Notice without a thought about it. You notice? The squeeze? Yes. Okay, and now there is in the back an awareness that sees and then there is the awareness and there is the, the sensation, right? It comes and goes. Okay. Okay. Like me and this and go back. Kind okay. Of. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Awareness. Sensation. Now pay attention to the awareness. And stay with that awareness as awareness. This is allowing for everything to happen by itself. Your attention is on the sensation? Okay. So as it comes, you pay attention and you almost look through it. Don't get stuck on it. Yeah, it is so, it has a feeling to be so much. Hmm? Don't be occupied with that. Because even the wanting or suddenly reporting it is dissolving, it's now the mind. Is is uh, is checking. Mm, what's, let's check this. <laughs> check. Let's check. See, it gets your attention stuck on the object. And once it's stuck on the object, there is the notion that you are perceiving the object there too. Mm -hmm. Separation. And who's, things, yeah. yes. who's doing it? And how do you know of these thoughts? Peering. Within whom? You don't even need to answer. Within who? You check. Anything that appears, disappears, instantaneously. It happens that when it appears, I get freaked out a bit, <laughs> panic. <laughs> um, because simultaneously it gets attached and I think that it is the true self and I am not again some kind of like a ambition like me. <laughs> That's good. So you watch it. It doesn't matter what I think I do. Ultimately, you only watching it anyway. <laughs> you just think you are involved in it, doing it, and you are watching that too.
To watch you mean to ask questions? A watch is means that you're behind it looking. Means but, yeah. you're right now looking at me. Yeah. What are you doing to see this form? Nothing. Right, exactly. No experience. <laughs> yes, not any particular experience whatsoever. 